Hey y'all, it's Wendy Johnson with Drive Across Texas and we are talking homeschooling again today. We've got a little bit different subject today. We're talking about working moms and dads, parents that don't necessarily just stay home and they get to do something a little different. So I have my friend Tamara Alvarado here. She is a homeschooling mom, but she's also a working mom. She brings in a little bit of extra income in her family and I asked her to come to kind of tell us what that looks like and how she handles homeschooling and having a Mother's Day Out program as well. Yes, so hi guys. Um, I'm Tamara and I have been a stay-at-home mom for seven years now, um, but I was so used to working that I wanted to make sure I was doing what I could to bring in the part. Because you know, sometimes that gets difficult when you go down to one income, because I am married. Um, so he works, my husband does work, um, but I did decide, okay, what can I do to bring in some extra money for, um, for us at home? So we did, we started a, um, it was kind of like a childcare program, and then it went down to a Mom's Day program. So Mom's Day out twice a week. Um, it's really nice, my kids absolutely love it. They do, because you have other kids that are um, in the house with them, or we go places, the library, before COVID, but the <laughs> library or the zoo or wherever we were gonna go that day, and we had extra kids, so it was really fun. And I was able to incorporate that with my kids, just having other kids at the house. Um, but I realized I had to make time to homeschool and to do that. And so I just really, um, on those other days that I wasn't doing home, I mean, doing the Mom's Day Out program, or maybe in the evening time after a nap or something like that, then I was able to incorporate homeschooling. So it's okay. been really nice. Mm -hmm. So you're able to balance both by having your Mother's Day Out program just a couple of days a week. Right. So that's how you make it work. I like that. Yeah, but I did have a child um, full-time, had him for about two and a half years, so it was kind of like full-time job. So it is, it is, um, possible to have a job and to homeschool. We would do things maybe while he was at nap time or we would just wait until the afternoon. Whenever we were free and I could get some time with my kids, um, it was really nice to be able to do that. That is good. That is good. You can make it work. Yeah. Right. Yes. So it, there is a possibility of, you know, maybe having your own in-home daycare or having a job of some sort because one of the beautiful things about homeschooling is you kind of make it work. Little one's napping, I get some stuff done, you know, he's not here today, let's get some stuff done. You can even, it's kind of like having just younger siblings in the house. Right. So you can make that work. Right. Very cool. Yeah, it's really blessed us. It really has. Yeah. And there you have it, folks. That's some encouragement for moms and dads out there that are thinking, oh my goodness, I have to work. How can I make this work? Well, whether it's a mom's day out or some other kind of program, an in-home childcare program or a job away from the house, you can make it work. You find the time. That's what we do for our kids. Yes. So thanks for sharing. No problem. There you have it, folks. Check it out. Bye, y'all.